guys so I just want to come back and show you some of the um, the items that I picked up for my kids for back to school I know I said this before but just for anybody who has not seen me say it before um, my kids start school next Tuesday which is September the 5th day after Labor Day and yeah this is just a couple of the items that I picked up I still have some more stuff to get by the end of this week today is Tuesday the 29th I don't know what day it is anyways so yeah stay tuned I'm gonna show you what I have so everything is not gonna be in order by child it's just whatever I take up that's what I'm gonna show you guys um, so I'm gonna start with the shoes first I still have to get Lene some shoes I need to get her at least three pairs of flats and a pair of sneakers so these are the boots that I got for her from RD regular price $49.50 but I got them at I think they were like 70 or 80% off because I know they ended up coming up to be $13 so yeah nice little wedge heel thing zips all the way up and these get her like literally just below her knee so nice pair of boots she can wear these because the fall is coming up um so so far that's the only pair of shoes i got her like i said she needs three more pairs of flats and she needs a pair of sneakers everyday sneakers and then inside shoe sneakers at school because she's only going into grade four so they still require them to change and put on inside shoes whatever Okay, these are for Justin. The brand is called Theory. Paid fifty dollars for them. This is for the days where he wants to look preppy. Just a pair of flats. Sorry, the laces are undone. He had to try them on in the store. But yeah, just a basic pair of flats for the days where he wants to be preppy. And they are a size six. Where is it? Can you see that? A size six in boys. All right. So this one's not in a box because I got this from the Karen section. But it's a pair of Adidas. It says Brooklyn on the front, and it has the. Brooklyn Nets logo thing and this is also in oh this is in a size six and a half and guess what you guys Justin is 11 years old and his foot's are like six six and a half and the good thing is I can fit into his shoes so whatever shoes I get for him it's like a two for one because I can wear them be right back I'm gonna put them on and I'm gonna show you see you guys Excuse my floor, but yeah, they fit. Has a little hook strap thing at the back. Excuse the scars on my legs and the fact that I don't have on socks, but yeah, they fit. He's not gonna wanna share shoes with me, but guess what? I don't care. Yeah, so back to me. So yeah, these shoes, I paid the Brooklyn shoes, I paid $29.99 on clearance. So that's a good deal. These are most likely going to be his everyday back to school shoes, seeing as how they're mostly black. So, oops. so that was for Justin. The most I need to do is get him a pair of gym shoes. Maybe another pair of sneakers, but who knows. That might be for like Christmas time. I'm already spending too much money. So I got a pair of Reebok Classics for Dro. These were $60. And they're in a size 9.5 in men. He's 13, turning 14 in a couple months. So these are going to be his everyday uniform shoes because I told you guys he's going to be wearing uniforms to school. So everything is like completely solid black except for this. But yeah, this is pretty much it. Black laces, good rubber sole. 
really comfortable inside. So these are gonna be the shoes that he wears with his uniform. And then his dad got him dust in the box, a pair of Converse. I don't see the price on the box, but yeah, the box was damaged. But um, these are the Converse. They're like a gray denim material. He won't be wearing these to school every day, but this is like a nice pair of shoes that you can wear on the days where they have dress down days where they don't have to wear their uniform, they can wear whatever. So I guess this is a pair of shoes you can wear then. So all I need to get him is a pair of gym shoes as well. And then I got these pants for him for $10 from a store called Stitches. It has the, I don't know what it is, elastic ankle. And it's the motor design with these ruffles and the zippers, full string waist, two pockets at the back. And like I said, these were $10. I need to go back and get him a couple more, but I didn't really focus on a lot of clothes for him because like I said, he's going to a uniform school, so, and he already has clothes in his wardrobe, so. I literally just added one or two pieces. Which one is this one? Okay, and here's another pair of pants that I got him. Just a plain solid black pants, pair of skinny jeans. Size 28. My booby fat is hanging out. Anyways, so I got him two pairs of pants. Probably gonna go back and get him some other stuff, but I need to focus on finishing getting his uniform. So I got Justin the same pair of pants, but these are from HM because he couldn't fit into the clothes from stitches. These are size 11 to 12 year old, and these were I think they were $12.99, and they come with the adjustable waistband. Nothing special about them, just regular plain black pants, skinny jeans. Oh my god my back is hurting me and I'm not trying to take up too much time from you guys it's already been like what five minutes okay so went to justice didn't pick up too much stuff in justice because justice is hella expensive you guys but if you watch my vlog you'll see that Lenny really like these pair of denim jeans it says hashtag happy they're jeggings Got them in the size 14 that she didn't want. And these are in the clearance section, so they were $14.99, regular price is $30. And yeah, it just has some of the distressed design right here. It says LOL, some more distressed thing right there. I already showed you the hashtag happy. Nothing special about the back, just regular whatever designs and a little bit of distressing so these are jeans for Lene from Justice a regular black pair of leggings I should have got her these are like nine dollars I should have got her like two or three of these because you can never go wrong with too many leggings she really likes this cat t-shirt so it's in a size 14 as well as you can see the little cat face and this was nine dollars if she'd be on showing you guys this she'd kill me but got her a little bra um i didn't plan on buying a bra from justice because of this little slingshot literally i could wear it as a headband do you see this it's so small I could wear it as a headband. It was $16 just for this. I will not be going back to Justin, but she really liked it. So it's a nice t-shirt bra. So that's what I need to get her. I need to get her some more little training bras and some underwear. But you guys, I have to make sure she doesn't watch this because she's going to kill me for telling you guys this. But 
for her one brought injustice only because her dad really wanted me to get it because it has like padding in there so now that she started to blossom they're actually really pointy so the regular training bras you can see them through the shirt still so the padding helps keep some of that pointiness down but i gotta find someplace else to get her a bra because like i said i'm not paying 15 dollars for one bra just a plain t-shirt seven dollars also from justice do you have anything else over here so literally that's it for justice So moving on, I just want to show you guys Draw's gym stuff. This is his gym shorts. Price isn't in there, but if I remember correctly, that's the the logo for the school that he's going to. He's going to a Catholic school. I think these gym shorts are like $16. For a pair of ball shorts that I could have got at Walmart for like five, but because of the school logo, I had to get those. So he has two pairs of these to last him for the week because they have gym every day. And then he has two pairs of these. Plain gray t-shirt with the logo. That's the name of the school. In a medium. And these are also like $14 or $15. And they're probably like $3 in Walmart. So, not too happy about that. This is the golf shirt with the logo. I think the shirt was $25. She has two of these. It has the logo for the school right here. And on the sleeve, she has two of these. These are the pants. I ended up getting him two more from after the day of the vlog. When I was back in school and I wore a uniform, he used to be able to go to Sears and just buy regular uniform pants, buy a regular white polo shirt, and then he only had to buy major stuff like the sweater with the logo or the vest or the kilt or whatever, the tie with the, the plaid, like you know, whatever colors of school were. But now you have to buy the pants because the pants have the logo on it. Literally. So a regular pair of dress pants. These are $45. They come unhemmed. And they come with this thing called hemming tape. You get one with each pair of pants so that you don't actually have to go to the store and have them professionally hemmed. I don't know how it works yet. I'm going to figure it out because I need to have it done by next Tuesday. So... Yep. So like I said, he has three pairs of these to last for the week, two golf shirts, the gym clothes, and that's it for draw for now. What else do I have? So these are some of the stuff that I ordered online because when I went to the store, I could not find these things in the store. So this is mostly t-shirts and stuff. They're from Old Navy. They were $5 each because they were having like some 50% off sale the other day. So, for Lene, it says Girl Power at the top. Let me see the regular price of the shirt to tell you what the price is. There's no price, but if I remember correct, they were like regular price $11.50 or $10.50, and I got them 50% off. So, it says Girl Power. And then it says, keep it going. So that's a shirt for the name. Another shirt for the name, Free Spirit. This is a Free Spirit forever. Then it says, hashtag, you do you and TTY, I'll talk to you later. So yeah, I got her a bunch of graphic tees because like I said, she's still in grade four. She's going to be wearing mostly leggings and because they still do carpet time and all of that stuff. So I need her to be comfortable. So graphic tees. I need to get her some hoodies, but it's not hoodie season yet. So right now it's t-shirts. And all of these shirts are in an extra large from Old Navy. This one says 
New York City. I love you. I'm sorry if you guys can't see, but yeah. Just trying to get this done quickly. This is for Justin. This is a large. It says USA. And all these shirts are, I think, 100% cotton. I don't know. Whatever. They're $5. pair of flora leggings for Renee. She's gonna wear these with either a white shirt or a black shirt. Another t-shirt for Lene that says genius. It's plain at the back. but cute. Pink shirt, black and white part. She could wear this with leggings, she could wear it with jeans, whatever. This is for Justin. Brooklyn Bridge. Plain t-shirt. And all these shirts that you see that I'm getting for the kids, they actually sat down online with me and picked out the stuff they wanted every now and again i'd be like oh no that's ugly or no i don't like that but there were a couple stuff they didn't have in their sizes so like i said those are the stuff i'm gonna actually try to go find in the store another pair of floral leggings like i said she could wear this with a black shirt a white shirt solid print shirt solid top because it's so much going on in the print so these are the stuff that i ordered online because when stuff like that goes on sale, trying to go to the store and finding them while they're on sale is impossible. So I'd rather just order them and have them shipped to me. This is California. This is for Justin. And it's also in a large. Another pair of leggings for Lene. It has the swan print on it full length, not the crop ones. And I realized they have this in a t-shirt, so I'm gonna get her the t-shirt for it. Obviously, she's not gonna wear it top and bottom together, but I like the fact that she'll have options. And another t-shirt for me. It says, love who you are. Okay, so that's a little bit. I have six more short shirts for Justin because you guys are probably like, oh, then they got so many shirts. But these shirts, they sent me the wrong size. He wears a large, but they sent me medium. So these, I'm going to actually go into the store. These are all just plain t-shirts, but I'm gonna go into the store and exchange them for a large. I know Soul Navy doesn't have a lot of good graphic t-shirts for boys. Any shirts that they have that are graphic for boys tend to be more on the kiddish side and he's going to middle school. He's a big boy now, so. Anyways, they're just plain neck shirts. And I got it in this burgundy color. Apple red. Solid black. I know you guys can't see through the plastic, but if I'm bringing them back, I don't want to open all of them because they're all the same size. Oh, I showed you the apple red, I showed you the black, a navy blue, and a white. You got this shirt for Jim. It's their old navy active. He only has Jim like two or three times a week, so. He's gonna be wearing this every day. He has gym, he bring it home on the weekends and wash it. So active go dry. This was like $7 on clearance. And then just a pair of basketball shorts. These were also $7 on clearance. So all of these things were too small. I need to bring them back and get them one size bigger. I guess they ran out and thought they could pull a fast one and send me the smaller size. So even the receipt says 
the right size that I ordered, but then the actual clothes that came are a completely different size. So. That's that. For that. You got it. I have like, what, eight minutes left, so I'm gonna try to do this quick. Phone is running out of space. So these stuff are from Children's Place. They had a 60% off sale the other day online, so I went online. The shirt was inside out because it's in a bag with a bunch of denim, so I don't want it to rub off on it. So that's why the shirt's inside out. So this one says hashtag boss and the emoji is daddy. This is for Justin. And then I got them jeans. The jeans were $8. So I got them all a pair of jeans. All of these are skinny jeans, so. And they're pretty much plain. So yeah, nothing fancy about them. They're going to school. So this one is in the indigo color. I don't know. So yeah, skinny jeans. So these are for Justin. These are for Justin. These are for Justin. Like I said, nothing fancy about them. Just regular jeans, regular pockets at the back. Just all in different colors. The most I need to do is go back and get him two pair of distressed jeans. He already has a black pair of jeans. And he wants an army fatigue pair of pants and then probably like some track pants, but he doesn't need all of that for next week because he's not gonna wear all of it on the first day of school. So I can still go back and get those stuff. But these are for Vene. They're super skinny jeans, size 14. And then these are for Vene. So total, Vene only got what, three pairs of jeans? Because like I said, I want to keep her mostly in leggings and sweatpants. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six pairs of jeans from Children's Place. Last bag for now from Urban Kids, and this is all for Justin. Another graphic tee. It says play game anytime. Is that what it says? Oh no, any game, anytime. Sorry, you guys, I thought it said fake game anytime. That did not make sense to me. That's why I put it. So it's in this like, nice little pinkish, what is this, salmon color? I don't know. That's that. And these shirts were like five or six dollars because Urban Planet had a 40% off sale. I think they still have that sale going on right now, actually. So. I might just go online and see whatever else they had, and it was only like five dollars for expedited shipping. So I was like, "Why the hell not?" This army shirt type thing with the what is this? I don't know what this is called. You know, the rounded bottom. So it's fatigue here, fake zipper here, black in the middle, and then army print at the bottom. black hoodie army print on the inside I don't know what's with this kid in the army print but whatever oh I thought there was army print on the sleeve but it's not short sleeve army print at the bottom zipper at the side he has this white cashmere what is this it looks like cashmere I'm just guessing you guys you guys, I don't know what the hell this material is, but, oh, here it is. I still don't know what kind of material this is. Okay, polyester. 65% polyester, 35% cotton. I don't know, I'm calling this cashmere. They can't tell me no different. So this is a shirt with a hood and that curved bottom again. He has that in white, and he has it in black. 
they had it in um a beige color like the pants that i told you like, that i got for draw they had it in this type of color but they didn't have a size so i need to get that so i guess that's it thought i had more stuff but yeah that's it for my back to school haul so three kids seems like a lot of clothes but this is really like nothing I, like i said i still have more stuff to get so i hope you guys enjoyed if you're not already subscribed to my channel please go ahead and subscribe like this video share this video thumbs up this video and if you'd like to see them do a little try on lookbook to see what they're gonna look like in their clothes or what the clothes fit like or you know whatever just leave me a comment below and i'll definitely have them do that you probably don't even have to leave me a comment. I'm probably just going to make them do it anyways just to have a video on my channel. But yeah, you guys. So, I guess this is part one of my back to school haul. So, hope you guys are having a great day. Love you guys. Bye.